The story of the crucifixion of Jesus of Nazareth, according to the Christian faith, is one that has been told for thousands of years. A story of a man born in Bethlehem and one who ended up dying for the sake of humanity. More than 2,000 years later, after being nailed to the cross and eventually dying, the prophet of God now appears to have a knight in shining armor. Kenyan lawyer Dola Indides, who has one goal, to get justice for Jesus. We have a good case with the high probability of success. And I hope that is done in my lifetime. After having his case thrown out of the Nairobi High Court, he turned to the Netherlands-based International Court of Justice in 2013 to overturn the trial and conviction. I will therefore chastise him and release him. The story is narrated in the Bible showing that the trial before the Sanhedrin, which means assembly in Hebrew, did not meet the threshold of a fair trial, subsequently denying Jesus his human rights. Crucify him. In his lawsuit, which he drafted back in 2013, indeed is named quite a roster of defendants, including Pontius Pilate, King Herod, the former emperor of Rome, and the states of Italy and Israel. I am innocent of the blood of this just person. Indeed is who said he will be relying on the Bible for evidence, also pointed out the trial of John of Arc as evidence. He was burned at the stake for alleged heresy. However, years later, a case was reversed by a papal commission. A possibility. One many, however, say, will remain a pipe dream. <laughs> That's just so funny. I think it's because pe some people don't understand grace. The time you understand grace, you will know why he had to die. 